Hey, I got an idea. What if we recreate Katy Perry's firework using fireworks? Baby, you're a firework. Hi, I'm Nathan Walters, a music producer and artist who has sold over a million records and scored many national commercials on TV. But today, I'm making a song using fireworks. <laughs> Some good tones from this one. Some good <laughs> pop songs. <laughs> okay, we decided to come to our hometown and get some fireworks because uh, the tent looks so nostalgic. Reminds me of Dumbo. When I see an elephant fly. Hey, what are your thoughts? That's great. We should like copy of your thoughts. <laughs> nice. Okay, people, you're watching, right? And never buy this. If you see this, never buy you it. Might not your want to house, on that, Mary. your house can break down. Okay, so I don't know if we're gonna use Troublemaker. It has 25 shots. Warning: shoots flaming balls. What? Crazy! All right, we got it. Let's go celebrate the Fourth and uh, try to make a song with all this. All right, it's technically not Fourth of July yet, and my neighbors are gonna be upset that I'm doing fireworks. All right, we're doing recording this. On, gonna post this on we're YouTube. doing this? I gotta tap the box to get a snare sound. Let's do that. Uh, Here we go. Party time, party time, party time. Here we go. I think that's good enough. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, it's hot out here, 4th of July. <laughs> we got our drones happening. We're gonna shoot the these up. Sweat down. And uh, Ready? we'll see what sounds they make. So cool, let's do another one. The place on hard open service. This missile travels at high speeds. At long as okay. High speeds, guys. You have eight Ooh. Numbers. I only have seven. Yes? Yes. Are you trying to make me take responsibility of bad decisions? <laughs> you guys ready for another one? Storm's coming. Oh, car's coming. Well, no, there's car. We don't get to do fireworks because our neighbor lost his cat and he told us to stop doing fireworks. Great, no, so we're reduced to sparklers tonight. <laughs> Baby, you're a sparkler. We can save those other ones for later. Are you gonna do lightning in your music? I guess I could. That's nature's firework. This is the epic one. <laughs> <laughs> that's a fire too. He's having diarrhea. We didn't know that was gonna happen. <laughs> Throw it right down on the guy. Here you go. It's louder than I thought. <laughs> Going bad for our neighbor. He lost his cat and told us to be quiet. Spent all this money in fireworks. I'm sorry, neighbor. Should have taken care of the cat. Okay, I think we got everything we need. Let's do this. All right, we did it. I am so sweaty. This is what it's like to live in Nashville. No, this is what it's like doing fireworks where your neighbor is running around paranoid because he lost his cat because his cat escaped his home because he doesn't want to live there. Yeah. And now he can't find him because the fireworks scared him off while he was on the leash. So bigger. So we, we had to stop our fireworks a little earlier. We have more, but... Um, no, ruined. we'll do that actually on 4th ruined. of July. It was ruined, but we're going to take the sounds we did, we're going to put something together, and we're going to make the best firework cover we've ever heard. All right, I'm here in my home studio. I actually went ahead and put the track together. I'm going to break it down and show you exactly what I did. As you saw in the video, I hit the firework casing, or, or the bag, or part of the, the firework. Uh, this is the sample right here. So I took that and I'm gonna try to tr make that, turn that into a kick. So what I do is when I have a sample here and I wanna turn that into an instrument that I can control and play, I click on it, I drag it down to the very bottom and this little list pops up. I go to quick sampler and it turns into a sample here and now I can go ahead and trigger that. 
I wanted to go ahead and make this kick sound great and not just like I'm hitting on a bag. So in the sampler, and I went ahead and I pulled this in here just to make it a little shorter. And then I went and I added from Sound Toys. I used the Filter Freak, and this is what it sounds like now. Nice and hard kick. And then I went and made a little clap slash snare sound, and that was from one of the fireworks. Actually, I used this firework right here. I went ahead and pulled in. It's only just just playing a little section there. And then of course I went ahead and put Decapitator. If you know me, I love putting Decapitator on, on all kinds of stuff. So this is what it sounds like now. My kick and snare together. Yeah, that sounds good. And then I decided, okay, let's go ahead and take little parts of the fireworks and put them all throughout the song. I used this little section here. And then the end of it here. I just put little parts of fireworks all around like I took another and then the rocket put some reverb on it but then I, I went ahead and added some other sounds I went over and I used my Juno X one of my favorite keyboards so it ended up being like this um and then I I went ahead and said let's let's add a cello then I added a viola on top of that violin on top of that here it is all together oh no I did add some more I went ahead and added another kick and then I added a little hi-hat on top just going t -t -t -t. now all of that together I like that okay I think it's ready to do vocals let's, let's put some vocals down cuz baby you're the fire come and show the Thanks for taking the time out to watch me put this video together. I had a lot of fun doing it with my family, as always. And let me know if you've got any other ideas of an object you want me to sample and make a song out of. I'm up for the challenge. And uh, make sure you like and subscribe, share this video with others, and I'll see you next time.